Luigi is screwed. Despite being deathly afraid of Egad's poltergust, King Boo puts his non-existent foot the fuck down, holding his distant ground right in Luigi's face, making sure he hears, I'm not afraid of you. Considering Luigi's been virtually killing his people and holds the means to stop him, it's a shock he's so damn hardened. The fact that his own demise is within reach, and he chooses to defend his pride, his people, and fights his greatest enemy, makes him a true king. King Boo's final stand gets me pumped every time, cements King Boo as my third favorite Mario villain. This would have been number one, if not for the beauty that happens next. Throughout the endless adventures they endure, no matter where the spotlight's pointed, I can never pick just one Mario brother. Sure, sometimes one looks cooler than the other, but I'll forever be of this mindset. You stick with one, you stick with both. Mario is what makes Luigi, and Luigi is what makes Mario. And besides being just wonderful characters, their brotherhood is so genuine. It truly knows how to hit home. So when select games in the series emphasize that aspect, it's immediately a favorite, and Luigi's Mansion is a love letter specifically to that, because number one is the ending. Oh my god, I love this moment so much. After such a meaty adventure, conquering fears, and building character, Luigi finally makes it, and the payoff is excellent. My voice isn't enough. Please, see for yourself. Oh. God, my heart can't take it. There are so many feels surging throughout these final minutes, I feel like I'm getting a fever. A fateful reunion that caters to all good feels. The slow, heartwarming scene in the altar resembles a long-desired hug between Big and Little Bro. Graced by the emotional pause and beautiful music, it legitimately melts my heart. I miss you so much, bro. And the restoration scene can kick the ass of any bad day. It supplies the always welcome laughter after a job well done. And once it's all over, we see Luigi, the happiest he's ever been, crying tears of joy and laughing his ass off at the sight of his red cat livelihood, all safe and sound, all ending with old memories of the mansion and the marvelous credits theme. It's a magic that never stops dazzling. Perhaps it's just me being a softy, but I can never sit through it with dry eyes. By far my favorite moment of Luigi's Mansion, and incentive enough to revisit it endlessly. This is being Fawful's Minion. Happy Halloween, everyone. <laughs>